Good morning, beautiful people of the Defy J live stream and Zesty. That was Defy J's message to all of you legendary people. He was very chip and jolly at the start of his live stream, but then he had to head back to the Red Prison where he's about 1300 dry of that enhanced seed. Bye, have a great time. Something that is extremely rare, the double C drop. He had absolutely nothing to say, just quietly walked away from his live stream. But everyone knew deep down inside he was starting to hurt and then he had to just unleash this. And I just love how good the response was in his clan, all giving him the grats and the huge for the account. I had to jump into his live stream about 15 hours later and ask him if I could see his log. Could I see his CG log? I don't know. Could I see you subscribing to my live stream, Behemoth, right now without being gifted? Hmm. That's what I thought. So I got to feed the kids? Me too. All right. If I don't feed my body, Behemoth, I'm going to blow loads all over your face. Exactly. I've got kids too. Mine are just still in my sack. Unfortunately for him, I told him I need to save all of my YouTube pennies to pay for my son's brand new bike I'm trying to afford. Thank you for dropping likes every single day. A cold one only has one more video to release to finish off his series of speed running to be a grandmaster. And along the way, when he started off next, look what happened on the first ever KC. Run away. Perfect next, please. Oh, that's uh that's an item that we got. Did I get perfect? Okay, I got perfect next. He's only worried about the combat achievements, but 300 mil is still a nice bonus. I've linked his YouTube down below, and I cannot wait to see how quick it took him to finish off the tasks. Some people have been saying skill specs has been dominating the bounty hunter world. Let's see if it's true in this next clip. Back to back 50s! Come on, man! You've got it in you, bro! You've got it in you! That's one... Wait. And unfortunately for him, his first ever PK came along with a double death, but he had had enough of this terrible RNG from all the death matches he was continuously losing. He actually reached out to Mod Ash and say, theoretically speaking, would it be possible for a J Mod to make his RNG worse than other players for someone's own sick and twisted amusement? And everyone was super surprised by Mod Ash's response, saying, theoretically, it would be possible not by using their username, but by using something very unique to their account, like a random bank slot if it had a certain number of items in it. And skill specs were sure someone was messing with him. But then someone went on to say, imagine Mod Reach did it in 2014. And you may remember Mod Reach, who was the one involved in the corruption of the Corporal Beast dupe that almost ruined the economy of our entire game. But no one could believe what Mod Ash wrote back, saying that Mod Reach actually created a variable that could be set on accounts programmed by the notorious Rotten Potato to be able to set it on particular accounts by meeting them in game and then blocking them from speaking to the Crystal Weapon Elves if the variable was set. And everyone was super surprised by Mod Ash's response saying that Mod Reach actually put something in the game where he could go up to players and he programmed it so he could use the Rotten Potato to make players unable to ever speak to the Crystal Weapon Elves. But to be fair, this was actually for a good reason so people couldn't go get the Crystal Bow and continually rag players had accounts that were completely glitched and couldn't speak to the elves. Very cool. Mod Ash thought it was widely known, but a lot of people just couldn't believe it was true. Rudy's going for his fire cape, but he also wants to try and tick off a very risky combat achievement task by tanking a hit from Jad. There it is. Wait, you gotta serve. Oh no, I double eight, so it didn't count. I'm back to full HP. I didn't get the CA. I technically did what I was supposed to do, but I didn't get the CA from it. Some very good skills, but some very bad luck. Let's see if the donator has some bad luck or some good luck while out at Bounty Hunter. Mm. 
One of you legends commented that you can get PJ'd at Bounty Hunter if it's your target. It looks like people are using that as a tactic to fight someone and then when they're very low on HP to just PJ them. And because they're the target, they get priority to make it completely overpowered. I don't know if something will be done about it though. Dino was doing some fun little pure PK, but he didn't expect to get this along the way. AGS on the floor. Yoink. <laughs> Thanks for the AGS. Appreciate you. We will uh, be taking that. And he must have had the pit of the gods. People were standing on that loot pile. I can't actually believe he got it, but it looks like that's the biggest PK we're going to see from him this week. That wasn't a paid actor. Mog time was going in for a fairly big death match where you do your specs with your AGS and then you fight it out with full Guthans, but he did not remember his Guthans war spear. He's let go. <gasps> oh my... We start the DM, boys. You're kidding me. I forgot my beer again, you brain dead keys. He do hit me! I forgot my spear again! Oh, hell no, BRB. Oh, hell to the back. Crusader Talent is the biggest content creator group in old school RuneScape, which I'm very happy to be a part of. And the legendary owner and manager Mason has organized a $5,000 tournament for 16 of the creators, which will be happening next weekend. So get very excited by that. And shout out to Jagex because it's actually officially sponsored by the old school team. Good old Sido hacking the game. This Revenant Knight doesn't even know where he's standing. A sneaky little safe spot that granted him this. Um... Yeah, that's pretty good. And I can't believe he left that poor godforsaken genie out there. I hope he didn't actually get to claim any lamp. You ever just take a second to think about the number of inconsistencies involved with having molten glass in your backpack that has been molten for an indefinite period of time that you are then taking out of your backpack underwater with your bare hands and blowing it with a glass blowing pipe wearing a fishbowl helmet. Yeah. How good was Mammal's response just dropping the year, but perhaps he should take over this channel. P mod streamer banned for botting, blowing molten glass with a bot live on stream. A great title if I say so myself, but someone who has not been getting great drops is Nick Tuhardo. She hasn't seen a unique in a long, long time. Oh, baby! My little... I'm well gassed about that. I don't even give a f that it's useless. Don't care that it's useless. Don't care. I'm f gassed that I got a drop from a f boss. It seems the dry streak on the uniques made her inner demon come out. We probably had to blank out most of that, but I think you can guess what she was trying to say. Our viewer was very impressed by Roydy's one tick flicking and asked him if he could help him figure out how to do it himself. Can you help me learn the one tick pray flick? I can't do it on my own. Do you want me to just like sit in your chair behind you like we're in like a ceramics class and like kiss your neck while I flick for you or something? What? And a lot of us, myself included, would pay good money to have Roydy sit behind us while we're gaming doing that. But Foe's response to it was absolutely classic. In your chair behind you, like we're in like a ceramics class and like kiss your neck while I flick for you or something. Bam. Rasty loves to send the solo level 400s. He's done 165 experts and 189 normal runs. You won't believe how many of these he's received. I'm calling it to fang. Can someone clip that please? And and I need a moment. I just I, I need a moment. So at under 400 k C, this fella has received five staffs totaling way, way over 5 billion GP to be the richest man in the game. If you're an Iron Man, do not watch this next clip. You will be triggered. There are starving Iron Man on Lunar Isle, desperately trying to buy soul runes. I have a... <laughs> I have a message for all Iron Men. You all. JDBCK is currently doing a subathon, and one of the forfeits was he had to put on a dress. 
Oh, damn. <laughs> now some dancing. Now, I don't know if that's going to haunt my nightmares or go straight into my spank bank with that twerking ability, but it wasn't even the worst thing he did that night. Mm. Oh, boy. Uh, you're going to stand there, you're going to face me, and you're going to say, who's your daddy? <laughs> who's your daddy? I'm f Are you kidding me? I got it on the wound. I'm up to clean now. <laughs> Part of me wishes I could see him get cream pie while he was in that dress. All right, let's see. Hunter, confirm, accept. Woohoo! Now I can play the game. Easy. A big grats to High Alk on maxing his account, and a big grats to you if you watch this channel every single day and drop a like. Thank you so much.